Now we go to the other part which is you So let's discover those two chords going up to the six. Those are two parts chords. So the first one is on the flat five is left hand I have D, G flat, B flat, C, right hand I have F, C, F, but you play grace note, B flat to C. And then you take that whole movement up a whole tone to the flat six left hand i have e a flat c d right hand i have g d g grace note c to t so that's So let's look at that on over the six U alone. So for my left hand, I have F, A flat, B flat, C, E flat. Right hand, I have A flat, C, E flat, A flat, U, A, L. Okay, that's how I play it. So firstly, we do the right hand chord, which is A flat, D flat, F, A flat, and then you play a left hand bass 5 only, uh, so that's E flat and B flat, and then you catch this chord on the left hand, you jump over to this chord. So the left hand um, chord is D, G flat, A flat, B flat, D flat, and F, right? And then you go to the, that's over the five, and then you go to the one, right? So the same thing. So that's two chords. Let's look at that one. Okay. For the left hand, I have G flat, C, and F. Right hand, I have A flat, C, F, A flat. And then you just play a single melody note, G, and then you go back to that four. Now we've covered this um, in the previous part. Right, so I won't cover that again. Um, so that's over the four. So um, that would be flat five, flat six, six, five, one, four. And then we go to the three. Now over the three, which is C, you have left hand, C, E flat, G, B flat. Right hand, I have E flat, G, B flat, E flat. And then we go to the one. to play that again okay so after the three you go one so the first chord over that one is left hand I have a flat G flat right hand I have D flat G flat B flat and D flat 
that's the first chord over the one the second chord we just move chromatically down to the left hand remains the same the right hand changes to c f a c so that would be okay now you play that same four that we've been playing um, all along then you do this okay that's over the six so let's look at that after the four melody goes e flat f chord right left hand on the six i play f e flat right hand i play a d g flat and then i catch the chord like this that's the first one all over the six it's e flat left hand a and d right hand i have a flat um i have d flat and f and then you move down the um the right hand so it would be okay to g flat b and e flat and then you play over the two right so let's just listen to that four okay two one six so let's look at that those are the two one six oh, sorry seven not six two one seven so um we we were on the six so now we go to the two right um that's the so on the two left hand i have b flat a flat right hand i have d flat f a flat and d flat before we play that chord you just play this d flat c and then that chord and then you keep the chord oh yeah it's like that um so f the only thing that changes is your left hand down to the one okay you don't change the right hand chord to so the right hand chord remains the same um then you go to the seven okay now you play this chord for the left hand i have g f the right hand i have d flat f a c it's really nice chord there you remain on that um for an extra bar then you do this okay that would sound like this okay let me add that on the left hand just to just to um, not just pause or sustain that chord you can actually jump over to this in your left hand on that seven so it's F and B flat you keep that right hand chord the same as just the left hand that moves to that and then you play this flat seven now let's look at that you first play the melody d flat e flat and you do this g flat on the left hand and then you play chord on the left hand which is e a flat b flat the right hand you would play um, A flat E then you go down G flat E flat E D flat E flat C and then you add um, you end on this so the left hand remains the same the right hand changes to 
um, D flat, E, A flat, B flat, right? Now we go back to the six, U, right? So on the six I have F, E flat, right hand I just have E flat, A flat, C. Now we play the flat five again, uh, right? This time I have for the left hand on the flat five is D, G flat, B flat, C, right hand I have G flat, um, B flat, C, and E flat. And then we repeat that seven that we had in the beginning. So that's the only difference this time around. So if you're on that six, you, uh, that's the only chord that you add, which is the flat five, and then you go back to the seven, three, six, and then you go back to the one. Four, oh sorry, it's first flat five, four, and then two, one, two, five, back to the one. Okay, so yeah, um, this was quite a lot, um, and I hope you've learned. Please feel free to ask questions. Um, if it doesn't make sense, maybe I could elaborate more. But um, I hope you have fun, and thanks for watching.